Senator Charles Robb has offered Governor Doug Wilder an olive branch in an attempt to halt the controversy surrounding the illegal tape recording of Governor Wilder. Senator Robb wants to meet with the governor tomorrow, as soon as he returns from Europe. But Governor Wilder says Senator Robb will have to travel to Richmond to talk. Governor Wilder says in this release he is a victim of a crime. The governor goes on to blast Senator Robb for trying to cover up his staff's possession of an illegally tape-recorded conversation. Governor Wilder says blaming the victim will not change the facts or excuse the conduct of Senator Robb and his staff in this eavesdropping incident. Senator Robb's spokesperson, Chris Bridge, says she's concerned about Governor Wilder's motive. Well, I'm not sure what it is that is trying to be achieved uh, on the part of some people, and um, I look forward to uh, having that clarified. We need to know the answers. State Republicans are more critical of Senator Robb's staff than Governor Wilder. We're dealing with a group of people uh, that feel that they're above the law and have now demonstrated that they're willing to go to any extent possible to intimidate their opponents and they're willing to trample the law in an effort to do that. Republican leader Joe Elton says his party wants an investigation into how and who taped Doug Wilder's phone conversation. The governor has not ruled out an investigation nor a lawsuit against those responsible. This latest revelation involving Senator Robb and Governor Wilder is certainly their most controversial skirmish. With state lawmakers up for re-election in just five months, Democrats hope the pair will be able to iron out their differences. In the meantime, Republicans will no doubt be cheering quietly from the sidelines. At the state capitol, Roger Harvey, WTVR News 6.